I'm in my studio today and going to sew some more cushions and label some more things and then another time I need to organise my studio but today I'm going to just check off some things on my to-do list and make some more products for my website. So. Recently I made these three new ones and now I need to check how much fabric I've got left to make the other two or three cushions. Hopefully I can get three out of the fabrics, um, so we'll see. These are the fabrics I've got left to make cushions out of. This brown and white one, some waffle pattern, and then this one, and these. But I'm only going to use one of these pieces. This one I'm going to save to make a scarf later on other piece I think I'm gonna make one big cushion out of just like this one so that's what I'm gonna do I sew a line in the middle so that the edges don't fray and then I can cut the squares for my cushion. Today I'm using my Singer Traditional and it's just a really simple one to use. Just change the, um, the thread, change the white thread. zigzag setting and I'm gonna sew in the middle I've sewn a line down the centre so now I can cut in the fabric without it fraying. double-sided cushion so there's different patterns on each one <clears throat> and they're gonna go together so I'm gonna sew them together right now now. I'm gonna have this as the top of my fabric. 
to conceal it. So I'm going to put the right side of the fabric against the right side of the zip and put it in place. the other side. And that is the right side of the fabric. So come out like that. If you have any questions leave them down below in the comments and I'll put a link in the description for my website where you can find my cushions and all my products and some more helpful tips. size together and here's the zip. So I'm gonna put it inside out again and then sew each length and then as I do that I'm going to sew in all my labels. Bye-bye. 
Here's the final cushion. It's made from lamb's wool. So, the wool I used for this one, this kind of fine lamb's wool yarn, I'll put the link in the description because it was really good. I'm trying to find the other colours. It's the yellow one and then some pinks as well and some green the other cushions that I'm making next out of this fabric so I'll make those cushions next so next I'm going to make some smaller cushions a bit like this one that I did before this fabric I wove with kind of herringbone pattern half of the warp was white and half of it was this brown colour and then chunky waffle weave as well just pinned the zip in place. The right side of the fabric is against the right side of the zip again. finished now and they'll be on my website probably when this video goes up so I'll put the link in the description thanks for watching